Hey everybody, how's it going? Uh, it's me, Supernotus, back with more Ghost of Tsushima. Let's put this music off, because I don't need that right now. Uh, yeah, so, uh, welcome to the aircraft hangar, where my PlayStation sounds like it's about to take off. Uh, but I think we'll be alright. Uh, <laughs> I'm assuming. Uh, last time out we did a couple of quests. We did the first thing with uh, Yuna. We obviously got defeated up here. Uh, because you can't get away from that fight and you can't win it either, apparently. I was looking into it, and uh, although it looked like you could maybe take, uh, what's his name, Kotun Khan's uh, health down to zero, uh, I had a quick look, a bit of research into it, and it turned out that if you do take his health down to zero, nothing happens. He just carries on fighting you until he eventually knocks you off the side, so that's nice. Um, so yeah, we cleared like three missions, two little side quests where we had to gain some allies, which we did. Uh, that's the next mission for uh, Yuna, where we have to try and look for her brother. Uh, but right now, I'm going to head over here for this quest, the other side of honour. See what it's all about. Someone mentioned seeing a samurai alive in Kashine. If another samurai made it out of Komodo Beach, I need to find out who he is. Hey, thank you so much. Thank you so much, and yeah. Uh, it's, been it's been pretty good, I suppose. <laughs> Can't complain. Thank you so much for the follow, Sci-Fly. And let's somehow get started. <laughs> I'm on a roof. I don't want to be on a roof. <laughs> How are you today? Let's go. I need to remember where I'm going, because I didn't mark that yet. Off we go. Off into wherever we're going. <laughs> You're the first person to say that. <laughs> well, no, not entirely. Oh, look, this guy's there. He's been killed by a bear. And I'm going to get killed by a bear now. Why did I decide to attack the bear? Why did I attack the bear? Yeah? Yeah, oh yeah, they can. Yeah. Uh, I'm not... I am i haven't been back at work in a little while. Is that bear gone mad? What's it doing? I haven't been back to work yet. I'm due to go back. Oh, I just got launched through the air by the bear! This isn't a great start. I should have stayed away from the bear. Oh no, it's coming. I am good. I'm good. Uh, I'm due back, I think, at work like next week sometime. So getting in as much as I can, you know, while uh, while I can, I suppose. Um, but yeah, yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. Just as you say, yeah. Uh, not looking forward to having to go back and deal with customers myself. <laughs> Otherwise, yeah, I've been just, you know, at home with the family, really. <laughs> Where am I going? <laughs> ah, don't want to fight any more animals. We almost got destroyed by that bear. get by, won't we, eventually. It's all we can do. Oh, it's that way. So it's this way somewhere. What kind of places are you working? I am actually got a a bike was what I got one of the presents I got for my birthday actually um, decided I'd rather start cycling to work instead of oh, I've gone right past it instead of getting the bus or whatever at least it means I don't have to worry about other people <laughs> I 
and I noticed, um, like, I went to one shop uh, locally, and they had, like, three bikes. Or you could buy a, a £1,200 electric bike, and I was like, yeah, I can't really afford to, buy, to have one of them. <laughs> well, it wasn't me that was paying for it, but, you know. What is this place? It's like a stable. 11 hour shifts, yeah, I, I, I try to only do them around about Christmas, you know, when it's, but I guess right now, I mean, as I say, it seems to be a lot of people buying bikes, so, it's a good time to be in that kind of business. Jack looks a bit red to me. If it looks very red. Yeah. I can imagine, yeah, no, it's, um, I mean, I only tend to see it probably around about Christmas, you know, when it's, like, hundreds of people and they're all desperately needing to get something and very angry if it's not there. And... But that's the trouble, yeah, it's... I want you to start running out of stuff. That's the worst time, isn't it? You know, that they're all like, oh, where's all your stuff? Well, it's, uh, other people have bought it. <laughs> but yeah, I wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't want to want to do, like, nine till nine or something. No, I wouldn't, <laughs> wouldn't enjoy that. But yeah, no, I mean, the... I'm looking forward to getting out and probably... I haven't been on a bike in years. <laughs> but you never forget, do you? That's what they say. That's the... That's the, uh... That's the story, apparently. Follow you? We're going to have a bath. Hmm. This guy sounds a bit... I don't know. Doesn't sound completely above board to me. Doesn't want to have a bath, he wants to look at his horse instead. I could have looked at the horse before, why can't I look at it now? Alright, so what have we got here? We've got... A brush. Normal, normal tools for a normal horse. And a stolen saddle. Everything's looking very blue right now. Is that because it's getting dark? <laughs> but yeah, no, I, as you say, it is. I mean, it's... You like to try and do as best you can for, for people cycling, but... Oh, I can imagine that sounds like it would be good fun. If you're if you're uh, if you're used to being out and about on a bike, you know that's definitely something that would be good fun. Getting out into the the, the wide open countryside, mountainside, and uh, I do know where he went. Found him. I think I've found him. Just getting out there, free to kind of all on your own. Doing whatever, uh, whatever you want, really, I suppose. This guy's pretty fast. For someone who might not be a real samurai. <laughs> I'm tiring out. He's still running. I'm like an old man. Yeah, I mean, that sounds like, yeah. Oh, he stopped. Definitely the kind of thing that would be quite enjoyable to do. A loud noise there. <laughs> he wants to fight me. And I will find out if he's a real samurai or not.
What's happening? What's going to happen? All oh, right, okay. Oh, he's given up already, is he? Yeah. Ah, so it's all kind of set up, ready for, ready for all that kind of thing. A downhill, a downhill biking just look, always looks to me like it, it's probably one of the most, uh, one of the most difficult, if not dangerous, ways to ride a bike. Well, except for that that thing. What's what's that one where they uh, where they ride through the like urban you know, down the stairs? Is that in like Italy or something? Like, down a huge steep flight of stairs. That looks amazing, <laughs> terrifying but amazing. So they kind of set it up as a whole. I suppose that's it. Get the the. He's just, he's just standing there. Get the winter sports business, but also the. Keep it running, as most of these places do, I suppose. I ran past a bathhouse, bath area. Oh, and there's also something there. This bath place. I can in increase my health here. Yeah, that does seem like it would be a a good thing to to watch at least. I don't know if. Uh, Well, I don't know if I can show this scene. <laughs> Am I allowed to show that? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. Canada is a, is a, a place I'd love to go and uh, visit at some point. Our health has increased. The other thing I've done, kind of close to, to that, I briefly worked at a ski sort of area in uh, in Scotland, in the north of Scotland here. Um, but I didn't really, I, I, I've, I've never really, I had never really skied prior to that. But it was good fun. Jeez. Oh, I know. Oh. Oof. <laughs> That'd be the worst feeling in the world. The brake just snap it off. That'd be just. You'd be terrified. <laughs> I can just imagine the kind of. Oh, I didn't want that. The kind of immediate response. In your head, I suppose, is kind of like, what the hell am I going to do now? <laughs> Oh, it's up this mountain, isn't it? Let's go and look at this undiscovered location. I know I've got a mission I'm supposed to finish, but we'll do that in a minute. Is it this way? Yeah. Oh, he's very tired. He's not in the best of health, this, this guy. What do you do in that kind of situation? Wait until you get to a level area and kind of throw yourself off. <laughs> I suppose you're going at the kind of speed that you wouldn't, you wouldn't, uh, you definitely wouldn't want to do that. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely the kind of thing I would have loved to have done, you know, when I was, when I was a lot younger and on a bike. <laughs> Definitely more fun, and also it probably the only time I went, I went skiing one one time, well snowboarding actually one time, and uh, the thing I find I found the worst about it was wasn't wasn't on the day, it was when you got home, you know, and you've been sitting around for a little while. And suddenly you're in agony all over. You you like sit on the couch and you can't get up again. 
for like hours. Sorry, just one sec. It's fighting. <laughs> but yeah, I don't. I, I suppose maybe it's not quite as not quite as bad as that. You know, being in agony the whole time. <laughs> unless you uh, unless you fall off, of course. All right, everything's on fire. Not a great sign. Oh yeah. Is that like the? Oh yeah, like the one that kind of that, that kind of the the water shoots out of or whatever and lifts it up. Is that the one? Oh, I don't think that's where it was meant to go. <laughs> oh, maybe it was. Because I know they've got like the. Am I thinking of like that jetpack style one? Sound like it sounds like something that would be quite enjoyable if it's Or is it like Oh I don't know. <laughs> it sounds It sounds familiar, but no, it's not something I've ever paid a lot of attention to. I assume it's a similar sort of idea though, is it like the Jets of water that, that kind of propel you into the air, is it? No. I got there through the hole. Oh. Ooh. Oh, there's some bamboo down there. Just want to get up here. Who who would burn all this stuff anyway? Or is this like a forest fire? What's the Alright, okay. And so that just kinda fires fires it straight up. Sounds interesting. Sounds like it'd be good fun, and at least it, at least your landing's not so bad if you if you fall if you kind of fall slightly. Ah, oh, there we go. That does sound like something that would be that would be good fun. It sounds like something I would want to try, actually. <laughs> Compared to, you know, throwing myself down a down a mountain. Oh, well, thank you guys for the host. Might need to shorten that notification sound. Uh, yeah, yeah, you can do. Yeah, if you like. I got a charm of fire. Uh, what does that do? Deal bonus damage while at 50% of health or less. Yeah, okay. I'm already at that, I think. So, how do I get down? Oh, I can just do it there. Okay. Yeah, I'll take a look at that. In fact, well, I can just... One sec. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. 
Yeah, I see the thing you mean now. Oh, wow. I like the way that the, the kind of, the way the water kind of streams up so that allows you to do. Oh, did I put them off? Or maybe I put them off. <laughs> but yeah, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll definitely, I'll definitely have a look at some of it. Because it, it it sounds like something that could be that could be good fun, although there's probably not anywhere near me that does it. But <laughs> it's definitely something to look out for. Right, okay, so we cleared that. We need to finish this mission. Oh, I don't even know where I'm going. the wrong way. <laughs> yeah, completely the wrong way. Ow. Uh, I've not got enough health to be jumping off things. What am I doing? <laughs> I had a quick look at a couple of things there just to see. Yeah, no worries. I'll be here. <laughs> right, we're getting there. I seriously need to increase my health. Or are we going to fight our way through this entire... This entire time today with like a half a bar, bar of health? Maybe I should do that. <laughs> I'm not going to last long in some of the fights. Yeah, let's go and tell this woman that the guy wasn't a samurai at all, that he was a liar. And find out that she already knew or something. He told you the truth, see? I, I thought he might have been lying. <laughs> Did they not think what kind of danger he could have been putting himself in? With all these people around looking to kill all the samurais. Like, hey, let's just get rid of the, all the samurai. Oh, we couldn't quite get another technique point. That's a shame. That's a shame. But we did get another charm. A stealth charm. Um, so we got some stealth charms now. Charm of Shadows reduces enemy detection. Okay. I'll take it. I'm not gonna not gonna argue with that. Inside the house there looked very dark. But out here it looks fine. What's this guy? Oh no, he he is he is doing so oh no. I thought it was a bald head that they had there. Right, okay, so now we'll head over and meet Yuna. Help her look for her brother. Come on. Let's see if we can find her brother. I don't think the horse wants to go down a cliff. No matter how exciting it might be to jump off a cliff. <laughs> On a horse. This bird's having having a race. He's racing us. Pretty quick little bird. Oh, is there not a thing about following these birds? Oh, who's this? Stay away. Spirits of vengeful samurai haunt this forest. Sounds like a challenge. Maybe I shouldn't go in here yet. Wait till nightfall. Uh, about to start a new tale. Do I want to proceed? Yeah, okay. Why not? I don't know how successful I'm going to be at doing this, but <laughs> we'll give it a try.
Oh, he's still there. I won't need to sp Okay, oh, alright, he's saying he wouldn't need to spin tails, okay. So, I'll go inside the forest here. Search for spirits. A bottle of whiskey behind one of the trees. There's a lot of lanterns around hanging from the trees. And fireflies. This is going to be like one of those things where there's an inn in the middle of the forest. And they kill people in their sleep. No. Got a scroll though. Yagata Forest has stood long before me and will stand long after I'm gone. The legend says that every tree is the spirit of a samurai who fell protecting the island. Are these the whispers I hear? Are they crying out in pain, begging for us to repay them for their sacrifice? Or are they trying to warn us of something and protect us even now? Uh, I don't know. What I do know is for some reason I can barely see anything in this, uh, in these houses. The brightness. I don't think... Let's not put it too high. Maybe if I put that up a slight touch. The only trouble is sometimes... That doesn't help. Okay. Oh, another scroll. Light lanterns, repair shrine, make an offering to the kami. Ignore the voices. Ignore the voices. Ignore the voices. I don't know, there's a couple of people there. A couple of people there. Quite sure. <laughs> what exactly am I looking for? Light the lanterns, it said, but the lanterns are lit. Is there anything to do in this forest? Just search for spirits. I heard a noise. Yeah. <laughs> That's true, yeah, they just make things worse. Make your life more miserable. Oh, well, yeah, yeah. Sometimes the things they tell you to do are, so, are quite exciting though, right? There's a fox there. I can't do the fox den right now because I'm in the middle of a mission. Not exactly... So there's all these lanterns that it said and then pray to the kami. The only thing here is this house. How far into this forest can I go? What's the search radius? Oh, okay, there's quite a bit to look at actually. <laughs> oh, hello. I thought this was symbolized. I thought this was showing me something interesting. Yeah, I don't know what to make of what's going on here. Are they spirits? Are there spirits in the game, I wonder? What's this? Just a... Oh, hello. There's a fire there. Might just go in here quietly, just be careful. Oh, somebody's dead. Decapitated. Just lying there with his head off. Just having a nice sleep. Not doing any harm to anyone. Wait, have I not finished investigating the campsite? Was there more? Is there more to see here? There's a fire. So, if there's a fire, then this must have happened relatively recently. Right? Spirits don't leave footprints. At least not, they don't usually leave footprints anyway. Some sort of band of thieves in the in the woods. The problem is the footprints because it's dark. Follow the hanging bodies. 
Yeah, I think this definitely was staged to scare people away. It's not working though. Samar oh, hello. Bandits. That would make more sense than spirits, wouldn't it? Yeah, right, pal, let's just... Nobody saw me do that. Not very honourable, though, is it? Hiding in the shadows and shooting arrows at people. But two down. So what are they doing? Counting out their spoils. Who's going to be the best one to take a shot at first? Probably the archer. And now they're alerted. Okay. Well, let's fight then, guys. Come on. Okay, so we've got a guy with a long... Oh, no. Weapon. I need to be able to see what's going on. Uh-oh. Just roll back a bit. One down. Oops. Done. Finish. No. Oh. So they were making up a story. They were using the story of all these spirits to steal from people. I suppose that makes sense. I will go back, right, and this guy that was playing the flute will be gone. Ooh. Almost like he never existed in the first place. Oh, I've got, I can upgrade my katana. <laughs> okay, we are going that way. Yeah. It's a quiet night. <laughs> so you're back at work again tomorrow then? Or you managed to reach a day off yet? <laughs> or are you working every single day? Oh no, he is still here, look. I did, yeah, there wasn't much there to worry about. Just bandits. Killed them all. Wait, are we claiming... Oh, he's telling the story of himself. I did. No more, no more bandits. I mean, it's a good story, but is it as good as the story of a load of samurai ghosts murdering people in the woods? I don't know. Our legend has grown, I'm sure. Through the whispers in the woods. Jeez. So I must feel like it's just constant then at the moment. As you said before, it's just really hectic just now. Is that your usual sort of hours or just what you're doing right now? Oh yeah, there was that fox's den, wasn't there? Well, let's go and take a look at that while we're here. Get the improvement that that fox den gives us. Where was it? It was over here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Okay. Fox will be waiting patiently for us. All right, pal. You can show me show me your thing now. Oh, well, he's going past where those bandits were. Well, he would have led me right to them. Wait, 
that was right next to me. The horse has got stuck. <laughs> Only 55, yeah. I'm usually, when I am at work, it's usually around about 40, but... Yeah. But then I guess it's a, it'll be quite a busy sort of place. So, is it, so, so it's busier usually in the summer then? Oh, do you know what? I can maybe go to this first before I... So I take it it's more the... Uh, the biking side of things that's the kind of more popular thing there, is it? I mean, do you suppose people like to be out and about when it's a bit warmer, don't they? Not everybody likes going out in the, in the, in the cold. 40 hours. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's it, I suppose, you know, you're able to, like here, obviously, you can you can opt out of doing more than 48 hours a week. But the only time I tend to do anything close to that is sort of Christmas, you know. Uh, but yeah, I mean, 40 hours, and I guess it's not like you can say, oh, well, I only really want to do the 40 hours. They'll just be like, oh, well, we'll get someone else in. <laughs> Yeah, nah, well, of course. I suppose because the other, the other problem will be if anyone else has had to take time off. Yeah. Hopefully the money's alright though. Enough to... Enough to get by on well enough. At least a roof over your head and enough to, to eat well enough, you know. <laughs> and hopefully a bit more than that too. <laughs> but that's one good thing about doing all those hours, but then not even, you know, I... I don't know if I'd enjoy not having that much time to myself to do things that I enjoy, do you know, it would be... It would definitely be tiring. Okay, we're almost there. At ah, whatever this is. Oh, what's this place? The Traveller's Rest Inn. Okay. This looks like a nice place. It looks like it might have been a nice place at some point in time, but... What's happening now? Some sort of uh, fighting's going on here. At this end. I'm a bit far away to get that guy with my bow. Oh yeah, let's have a standoff. Let's have a standoff. Cool. Oh, I didn't time it right. Just pop that health up a little bit. One of those guys too. Okay. Dodge. 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 Ah. That's the worst thing. I ended up going inside the bushes. Well, he's not so tough. Oh, good. Your food's ready. Oh, we got more of them. I see you. There's no point hiding over there. I could see you. 
Oh, he's, he's not going to attack me from his horse, is he? Oh, their leader's there. The boss is there. Doing is spinning around in circles. I was waiting for that guy to come in and take me from the side. Was that a plan all along? Yeah. Yeah, he did look a bit confused. He was like... Well, he won't be confused anymore. <laughs> oh, look, this guy's... Uh, having some trouble. There we go. <laughs> yeah, sometimes you see little things like that where they just... I don't know. Have I cleared this area? Are there more to fight? Yeah, it looks like I've cleared it. Okay. Wait, is that... No, okay. Just that mission left for me to do then. Yeah, he did look very, uh... Very confused there, didn't he? Oh, well, there's another undiscovered location that way. Or maybe he was trying to confuse me. <laughs> Get the other guys to surround me while I was wondering what the hell he was doing. You know... Oh, I can hear Yuna shouting. I'll go and help her in a minute once I find out what this is up here. Is it up on the cliff or...? Yeah. Oh, a survivor's camp. You can get lots of extra stuff here. Well, mainly I can... Maybe upgrade something. No, I don't have enough predator hides. Anything I can sell? Not really. All of that stuff's useful, so <laughs> no point selling any of it. Oh, we've got a person that might be given as a mission. See what she's got to say. I do quite like this, um, this game in the way we just pick up sort of missions. We're just kind of meeting random people as we go around. Okay, so another rumoured location. Uh, there is a store here, but... I don't know if I want to do that. Because I can get an upgrade for my sword, and if I waste anything, it might not be so good. Oh, a gift. A spirit will lead me to whatever I'm looking for. We can get dyes. So what, we can dye our clothes? Our clothes? Oh, he's giving me the traveler's attire. But, yeah, so I can buy different design kits for my sword. Can't afford them right now, so I'm not going to worry too much about that. I don't know if I want, I don't want to wear that armor. It's not going to be much use in combat, is it? Right, let's go and do this mission now. Where's the horse gone? No. Oh, it seems to appear behind me. Okay. Even when I'm, like, on the edge of a cliff. The horse just flies up the mountainside. Okay, so we've got continuing the story here with this kind of mission. With old Yuna. 
think she's down here. Yeah, she is. Killing people. That's what she does. <laughs> Goes around randomly, brutally killing people. I suppose everyone is right now. Another mission done, or... No, we haven't even started it yet. What am I talking about? Another mission done, we haven't started it. <laughs> Did I find the samurai? Yes. I'm looking at my horse. I'm looking at my horse, and I had to shout it. Now, where are we going? Reach an overlook by the prison camp. Oh, yeah. She's uh, awfully sure that she's going to actually see her brother soon, isn't she? What, he's gone. Or dead. What's this place? Anybody in there? No. So where's this prison camp? Still quite a long way away. <laughs> Still quite far. I don't sure much about... well... He's a samurai, he's very stoic. Okay. Wait, do I have to cross that water? No. We're okay. We're in the right place, at least. It's a long ride that isn't totally clear about where I'm supposed to be going. I can get the wind to blow in the right direction. Oh wait, is that it up there? Yeah, that looks like an overlook. Looks like the place. Built a prison camp in days. I mean, okay, they only had to, like, hammer stakes into the ground, but... Where am I supposed to be standing? I have to be in a very specific location to look at this place. Okay, so what's, what's around? We've got this, whatever this is. We don't want to alert the guards, though. Yeah, that would be a bad idea. The defences in the back are quite strong. But there's a hole in the wall. Okay. We can try. So this... is going to need us to go in quietly. Yeah. He doesn't like that idea. He's not a fan of it at all. And there's a backstory on why. The trouble is, these, these people don't live by any such code. Mm. I don't know if I'll have much of a choice. So now I think it's all... Uh, we have to do things that are against our code of honour to get by here. 
stuck on a rock three feet from the ground. Not even. Okay, so I reckon we want to cross here. Quickly as we can. Take a leap. Yeah, here we go. Here's a gap. And there's a guard. So it begins. Kill everyone. As he resigned to the fact that he's going to have to just do this. Even though he really doesn't want to. But that is, I mean, from what I understand, the kind of direction the game goes. He. learns that the honourable samurai way of fighting isn't isn't going to be much use in this situation. But then he doesn't know how to do it quickly. The only thing that kind of confuses me about, about that part of the game is earlier on there was a mission where you have to you have to take a guy to to like a fort a, a fort type thing that's got guys that's got the enemies in it. And he tells you to fire arrows at things to blow up on them, so ambushing people's okay. But stabbing them in the back isn't. It's very, very odd. Right, so now we've got a little flashback. We're following a bear. I don't want to follow a bear. Well, it should be easy enough to spot. Why is the brightness too high? I think that looks too high now. Not much better, I guess it's just the way the sun is. In the game, if I look down... Maybe it's supposed to be like that. To make it harder to track the bear. It's bleeding. Stumbled. That'd be something to watch out for in the mountains in Canada, is it? Uh, bears? <laughs> Stay ready, he says. If it's still alive. Oh, where is it? Well, here he is. Here's the bear. Is it alive? No, that bear's dead. Very much dead. What, something, something's cut the bear at the side? Oh, there's a guy. Oh, here we go. So him as a, so he's as a child he's I suppose he's learning the same as everyone else. Mm. There's a lot. I know there's a lot of complaints about him. He's not got very many emotional responses, but really, it's not that surprising given given his training, is it? He seems like in the cutscenes, my PlayStation goes really quiet. Then, as soon as any action happens, suddenly it sounds like it's trying to fly away. Yeah, not stabbing people in the back, but uh, yeah. Gonna have to break that rule, sorry.
and probably quite a few more while we're at it. Come on. Okay, so that was probably the most brutal stealth kill I've seen. <laughs> In quite some time. Nothing, doesn't matter, nothing's wrong. He's just doesn't want to slaughter people. Use all your senses. So now there is a thing we can do where if I press the touchpad it'll show me where the enemies are and what they're doing. Have to be careful about being spotted because if we are, they'll kill all of the the hostages. So what have we got? We got those two over there, and they're both looking the other way. Oh 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 oh! And there's another one. right in the back of the head all right thanks very much for tuning in and thanks for fun thanks for the uh thanks for the follow as well hope you have a hope you have a good day at work <laughs> who else is here no one no one else is around Pick up all the stuff that's left lying around as well. There's another guy. Shield doesn't do him any good there, does it? <laughs> okay, we've got a guy in there. Who is dead. That's not much use. Some heads. What about any of those faces? Do any of those heads look familiar? Do any of them look like your brother? No? Okay. Just asking. <laughs> right. Oh. Who else is going to be around? I think there's a guy inside that tent. I don't know who else... There might be... There's another guy... Okay, so there's this guy moving around in this tent. Nice. Let's clear this place out. While we can. Two upgrades available. Get some artifacts out of this place. Quite a lot of stuff in here, actually. Not what I'm looking for, but... There's another guy. I think we'd be coming from the wrong side if I go that way behind him. Or to him, at least. This way should bring me round. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> gone. Next one. Get the door open and see if they know where her brother is. I just sneaked in, took everyone down and went away. We'll talk when it's safe. We're running on the spot, backwards. Okay, he's alright. Let's get going. Get the hell away from these people. Oh, that's 
シムラドのお助けお助けするにも人手が足りん手伝ってくれてるだがすげがさしゅに聞いてみろ質の氷で猛虎を襲ってるって聞いてる地平原の近くの海岸だ Hunting people by the coast. Okay. I think we're far enough away from this prison camp now, surely. A lot of prisoners move through. So, what? He was never there? He just never spoke to him? So he's, he's had us run all the way here. Is he going to go for a swim afterwards? Asimo B. <laughs> you better be or what? You're going to go and track him down? Well, we don't know that, do we? A friend who can get us inside. We need to rescue Taka. And more that will lead up to how we eventually rescue his uncle. Hopefully he doesn't end up like taking the side of the Mongol Empire. Lord Shimura can stop them. Why, in fact, why are they keeping him alive, I wonder? There's no good reason, surely, to keep him alive. Unless they want to, like, put him in as, as a leader that they've, I don't know, turned to their side. Presumably it'd be easier for them to try and hold places if there were locals in charge that they could trust. Maybe. One sec, just need to boost something a little bit. Volume on a couple of things. Right. Let's see what's going on here. Sorry. You can walk free. Well, at the moment, at least, he doesn't seem to be uh, turning to his side. Maybe later, though, who knows? Sorry. Well, yeah, of course she does. Because it doesn't seem like he's the kind of guy that would uh, that would do that kind of work for him. I'm sure there might be somebody, but. Like some of the stuff we've seen in some of the areas where like bandits are trying to take over some of the areas. Okay, so we've leveled up to the next level. Our legend has grown again. We're now the people's hope. The people's champion. Right, and I can choose a new ghost weapon. Wind chimes, attract attention. That always seems like that seems like it could be something useful. Just try and get some guys away whenever we are involved in any fighting. Uh, detect more distant enemies. Roll to adjust before landing. Oh, that'd be quite good. And all but the highest of falls. Slow time while aiming. Ooh, add a second standoff. Save myself from defeat when wounded, and that would cost me two resolve. At that stage, I probably wouldn't have any left. So. Oh. Let's have the standoff streak. I feel like that's a good idea. We got our stances, which we've got two of just now. 
How many of these points do I have? Three. I haven't spent any in ages. Um, two piercing strikes. No. That one could be useful because that's the power that kind of works for breaking shields. Do you know what? Let's take that one as well. And we've also got our samurai skills. What do we have here? Bamboo strikes. That'll increase my resolve. Let's take that. Resolve increases and health increases are probably the best things to look at. So now I can choose different ranged weapons. Right, so what do we have? We've got four tails available, apparently. Senji Ish Senji. Sensei Ishikawa there. Uh, who will probably go and help. We've got... Oh, Masako outside the Golden Temple. I need to go there actually to get some upgrades. We've got a couple of other missions. Blood on the Grass, the Straw Hat Ronin. Could possibly get them to help me too. There's still that legendary armor mission to do. Tadayori's armor. And this is the mission for Yuna, the Broken Blacksmith. So where am I right now? Oh, and there's this as well. People of Ariake are losing their homes to the Mongols. Look into that. Okay, so I'm where? Down here somewhat? Where am I? I'm there. Oh, right, I've gone all that far, all that way. And I've got an undiscovered location that's basically right in front of me. In front of me or behind me? Yeah, I'm behind me. That's uh, probably another one of those fox dens, I think. Yep. Better to follow the foxes on foot, I find. What's happening, fox? Across the river. Over the... River past the flowers... Why did he just go across and then back? What are you doing, you weird fox? Where are you going now? He's not going off a cliff, is he? He is. And then across there. Oh, that was close. Oh no! Yeah, don't uh, don't jump off there into the water. Why? Wow. Okay. So there's jumps across the cliff here, which will lead us to where the fox is, but. Climb. Sometimes these climbing grips don't work so well. Right, so... Oh yeah, look, I can see where the fox went. No. Down. Whoa! I almost went off the edge there. Okay, so it's over there. Oh, well, that's easy enough then. Honour the shrine. Oh, the fox came back. And I've unlocked a new slot for charms. Good. Good. Charm slot unlocked. Well, let's just uh, pet the fox while we're here. Because a samurai can just go around petting wild animals all the time. And he's obviously very happy. He's just... Uh, jumped up and down a couple of times. He's a happy fox. So we could go and do this mission, but I want to go to the Golden Temple first, so maybe we'll do that mission anyway. Because I'm going to fast travel to it, because it's easier. Not that I don't like riding around in here. And actually, the, oh, there was a big area that we hadn't investigated between here and there. Focused hearing to listen for enemies. Which is useful at least. Should mean it's not so easy to get caught out by people. Alright, we've got another guy here who's going to give us some sort of information. The, re the rest? Our resistance group. 
Are they samurai or are they... Who knows? Well, you know, I'll go and help them at some point as well then. Is this guy going to give me a gift? A present? A good man. あなたのお金で大勢が助かってます。いくさはまだ始まったばかりだぞ。だから俺もお手伝いしたいんです。みんなで礼を伝えてくれ。他に役に立ちそうなものがあれば、あなたの立ち寄りそうなところに置いておき
Well, there's a surprise. He ran away. I wonder what this, uh, what this is all about, anyway. Why they've decided to turn against her family. Money? Power? Who knows? So the next quest, the headman. Headman. The man that's ahead. I don't know. So we have to go or we'll lose him. She knows where he is. Alright, so she's not going to give her family a proper burial. Well, she has buried them, though. Until she's got her revenge. She can't rest. She ate yesterday. Am I calling her old? <laughs> I wouldn't dare. No. We should have caught up to Hachi. Um, what way would he have gone? Down the hill, surely. I don't need to sneak around, I don't think, do I? Hatchy. Could he be down here? There's a, is there something in the distance there? Oh, there's a cart. Oh, get off there. In case we get seen. So I've got to trail his cart. Okay, well, let's get to the other side of the path then. He can't see me right now because he's behind the cart. In fact, will he be able to see me at all? Does he walk alongside the cart? Or does he drive the cart? No, he walks alongside it. Okay. There he is, just uh, having a leisurely stroll with his horse. If they run into Mongols, he's on his own. Well, there's some guys there at that uh, junction who don't look friendly. Need to swap sides. Other things, he's got a bandit. Show us something. The bandit's approaching. So now, now we're following them. Where are they going to go? That way. Okay. Well, let's get up on this little viewpoint and see where they're going. Go on then. You can move now. He's the headman's brother. He has good sake. No sake, just a note. He'll kill them. Sado's a good family man, okay. From a bad family. Lovely. Bandits were slaughtering protesters. Cowards. He did the massacre, he's saying. Now is he just taking credit for something? To make him seem tough, or did he? Whoa. Why does he just randomly turn around? Oh, hello, we've got a little place here. Where these guys apparently are based. 
So who's... What's happening with them? They're not getting away, I'm here. They're going to see me if I go too close. Where's Masako? There she is. Woodcutting house. Guarded by a lot of people. These are her, his cousins. Right. She's just going to go straight in and take them out. Let's have a standoff then. Not too late. She's. They've noticed her. Yeah, I can't do a standoff now. Right, break his guard. There we go. Whoops. That was almost not very good. Wow, that guy's uh, pretty good at attacking me. I've used all of my resolve right now. That was close. I should use that one because it's better for breaking shields. Get rid of the guy with the shield. No, that was the wrong way. Ah, I broke my block too soon. Could try parrying some of these attacks. No, that didn't work. I'm having some trouble with my parry right now. Come on. Nah, you're not going to charge at me with that spear. Yeah, parry worked that time. There's, a, there's an archer there, though. Another one over there. Just get rid of this guy with his uh, with his spear. Is he gonna jump down or? No, nope, he's still up there. Can't get up there. Well, maybe I can get up there from here. Nope. He's gone. Oh wait, there he is. Nice little assassination kill for the end. Good. What are we going to find out here? No? Can't speak to her there? There we go. There's someone in the house and she's going to make them talk. I don't know if she's the best person to try and make someone talk right now. She's a bit terrifying. <laughs> right, let's chat to her. Who's this? Who are you, he says. Well, that's, uh, well, that's Sado's wife. The Mongols killed her family. We all know that's not true, though. Uh, what's going on? Sorry, I just need to quickly send a message. There we go. Right. So that's that mission done. I guess. Charm of Resolve. Cool. The Husband. Good name for a quest. So that's that mission. We've got some Asimov who want to fight back against the Mongols, but they're not samurai. 
Well, okay, let's go and have a look at that. I'm always interested in little side quests. Little things that we could be doing that are not sort of just a straightforward main story, you know. Ah. Oh. Mongol eagles. Well, let's have the standoff. Send your best warrior. Who's it going to be? Oh, that's right. I've got the twin uh, thing now. I've got two now. I got the standoff streak. Nice. Now let's have a normal fight. Who's next? My improved sword will help as well. Ow. That's not what we wanted. Wait, he's getting me whether uh, whether I block or not. Of course, because that's an unblockable attack. And I just let him hit me with another one. Is that all of them? Am I done? Anyone else? Looks like they're gone. Good. Is this guy... Oh, somebody's tied up there. Just free this person then. And she's glad I survived. Well, yeah. They burned her farm. Between Su and Asimo. I can see their men from the cliffs above, so there's a mission we might need to do at some point. Oh, some supplies. Uh, oh, I need to wait for that. You can't look at the map until. I'm not entirely sure what until, to be honest. And that is obviously the, the mission she's telling me about. Also, we've got a, an undiscovered location there. Well, let's go and look at this first. Let's go and see what this is all about. Uh oh Some boars. I don't want to fight some boars. That's one of those birds as well. Okay, looks like we're almost at the place that we were supposed to go to. Where does these birds go? Aha, he's shown me to one of these. Ah, these are quite good. And now these will give me um these will give me extra resolve. So you have to cut these, like, really quickly. You have to press the combination of keys, like, really quickly. Uh, X, 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 XL, one square. Straight through seven, there we go. And by doing that, I'll, I'll gain resolve. So now I've got four, which means I've got more chances to, well, basically more chances to, to improve my, well, recover my health. And also, this is where this mission starts. With this woman over here. Have I come to help the Azamo League? She got on her, on her shoulder. Is she a werewolf? She's going to look for her friends who were supposed to have been there hours ago. For Tsushima. Or Tsushima. Tsushima, Tsushima. I don't know. Hey, let's go faster. Follow her to the farm. Not the farm that woman was talking about. Oh, this must be a different one, surely. Well, that explains why she would know how to fight, yeah. Oh, 
Trumps her skills can be useful, yeah, hopefully. Not so different from a samurai. That's what you like to hear, isn't it? I'm not even going to mess around, I'm just going to go in and challenge them. doing it I wanted to I wanted to do a ah, he did he moved a little too quickly there All right pal ah, I wasn't quick enough there we go it's him down There, nice. Broke his, uh, broke his guard. Anyone uh, needing to be finished off? No, they're all dead. These are the men she was supposed to meet. Great. So her resistance movement didn't last very long. Which others? They found the main force. Help them. Let's go. I have to chase her down because she might get herself killed. I mean, she knew what she was getting herself in for, but. The potential to be killed. We're too late. Too late for what? There's a storm. There's a storm coming. Yeah. But she's not a samurai. Don't do it. You're gonna get killed. Don't do it. Can I do a... I can't do a... Um... Ow. Oh, archers. Where are the archers? Oh, there's one. Who's next? Can't see what's going on. Guy's gonna be a problem. Maybe not. Who's next? Who's gonna charge in first? Charging in behind and everything. Ouch. Okay. I maybe went a little far with my attempts there. She's dead. So this mission's over. Oh no. Oh no. I've killed a couple with Kunai, but I need to help her. I need to take down these archers before. Oh, if she dies, the mission's over. I can't do it. She's going to die. Nothing I can do about it. Where's this archer? Doesn't 
doesn't matter, the mission's over now, isn't it? Well, we got him, but unfortunately she's dead. Couldn't, couldn't clear that mission. But that's what happens. Or that's what could potentially happen. In every situation. He's not happy about it and I'm not really surprised. I just got caught up too much in the other people. And left her for cannon fodder. For Tsushima. Failure. But it still gave us an increase in our legend. Maybe not as much as if I'd rescued her. Still counts as completed though. <laughs> I guess we could have com tried to complete it in a more positive manner though. Alright, let's go have a look at this uh, rushing water crossing. Where are we going for this? That way. Oh. Okay. Random jump for no reason. Am I going the right way? Yeah, okay. And this was the place we just had the big fight at, wasn't it? Oh, we've still got a long way to go then. Okay. If I go along the edge of the river, we can probably pretty much see where we're going. Let's have a standoff with these guys just for fun. Getting a big guy with an axe. Who's next? Two down. nasty hit that first one okay so these guys their swords are quite rough oh and they're getting extra attacks in quite tough these guys ready for that attack, wasn't he? Right, he's done. He's finished with. Who's next? Why are they standing there like that? He's done. Just you left, pal. Is he hi trying to hide from me? Oh no. Oh, that was close. That was a very close one. Anyone else? Looks like we've dealt with them. Maybe. Oh no, wait. I wonder, there's someone all the way over there that I can kind of make out. <laughs> there is someone there. I'm not going to waste my arrows from this distance. No point. Okay, so some of those guys were a bit tougher than I expected. <laughs> Let's carry on on our way. Wait, did he come back? He attacked my horse. 
Oi. Where did he come from? I'm dead. I've just died. I can't recover. As he sticks his weapon. Where did he even come from? He like stuck his thing through my back. Right, well, get back on the horse. Okay, some of the guys around here are quite tough. Let's just try and avoid them entirely if we can. By taking exactly the same path as we did before. Because why not? <laughs> Don't feel like having a standoff this time, although there's less of them there. I want to go and see what this mission's about. They might be chasing me, though. Also, I could do with increasing my resolve. Well, never mind. It'll do for now. Okay, so we still got a bit further to go to get to this area. Whatever this fight might be. I want to fight all these guys. Yeah, why not? Let's try this time not to die. Against all these guys. Don't know exactly how many there are, but... That recovers my resolve. <clears throat> and that just makes sure of it. Anyone else? So there's only one of them there. Two. We can break his guard with the, uh, uh... Ow. Oh. Feels like some of the enemies are leveled to certain areas. Because they were a lot easier to fight than those other guys. A lot tougher. I'll deal with them. Oh, we got an extra technique point. Oh, yeah, I can't do it until everything's gone off the screen. Now it should work. So we've got another new place on the map, which is over that way. I don't want to go to one of them yet. Well, let's have that inf that deflection. Uh, deadly counter-attack. Yeah, that's a good one to have. Alright, where... How far are we from this place? It's this way. Rushing water crossing, right? They said they burnt it down. That's not it there, is it? Is this the place over here? Yeah, it all look is up. To get there, I'm going to have to... I've arrived at the location that I was looking for. There's wild animals nearby causing them problems. If that's the case, I'm going to try and get in this way. See if we can see any of them. There's one coming, Luke. Oh, there's another one. What are they doing? They're cutting through the grass to try and find people. I would have gone and went for that guy over there. 
Just as well it didn't. Right, is he going to go away, do you think? I wonder. He's not, is he? Oh, he is. I've been seen, I've been seen. It was only them that saw me. Anyone else down here? They're being attacked by boars or something over there. Uh oh. Did he see me or what? He's their leader. I'm assuming that I can't sneak up on him, right? I don't think we can do a sneak attack on these big guys. That boar's still there. That's a bear! Oh well. <laughs> Just watch him ragdolling the guy around for a little while. He's gone away. But he's going to be pretty hurt, I would have thought, because of that. Critical strike. Doesn't kill him, but... But that does. <laughs> Just let the bear do the most of the dirty work there. Right, their leader's dead, but does that mean I've cleared this area, I wonder? Yes, okay. It's counting that as cleared. Good. Got some steel, maybe we can get some upgrades done next time we reach the, the town. Some iron, sorry. Any enemies around? No. Okay. Well, we're done here. We're done here. Now, I can either go up here, do this Massacre story. Oh, wait, there's a marking on the map first. Let's go this way. See what it's all about. Probably could have got them from, from this area if I'd wanted to. In fact... What is this place? This is the woman's fire uh, farm that she said was on fire? It's very dark for some reason. It wasn't as, didn't look as dark as this, I'm sure, the last time I was playing this. Now, where's the place I'm trying to go to? It's not far away, I'm not going to bother using my horse to get here. Because it's just up here. Should be. Is it another shrine on the hill? What is it? Okay, it's up there. Just as I go to look at the map. It pops up to show me. Another fox is dead. Okay. Sometimes these foxes lead you running through crowds of enemies, though. There's a boar there. That's going to attack me if it sees me. It's seen me. It's after me. Hopefully I'll get to the fox thing before that boar catches up. Oh, I don't think... It, oh, well. I was going to say, I don't think it'll get through there, but I'm pretty sure a boar could fit through there quite easily. Honour the shrine. Although I think all this does is kind of leads towards us getting more slots for charms. 
Oh, we've done it. Please tell me that boar didn't follow me. Is there a way down from here, or am I going to have to go back the way I came? Oh, yeah. Fox was helpful, so... Thanks, little guy. This is a little bounding move. Probably shouldn't jump down here. I'm also pretty sure I heard that boar coming for me. I left my horse there. Whoa. What's going on down there? Let's have a standoff. Stand and fight, he says. That's an archer. I'd rather not have to fight an archer. Now, where's the second one? There we go. Oh, he's an archer, so... Yeah, that guy can charge at me if he wants. Oops. Give my sword a little wipe and put it back. Nice. And we've got something here. Some sort of thing. It's probably not much, but... Supplies. Good. What's this? Some people dead against a tree. I thought it was some kind of shrine for a moment there. <laughs> but it wasn't. Right, let's uh, head this way. I think... There's quite a few missions around this area. Ariake losing their homes to the Mongols. We've got uh, another area we can clear out. Kuta River Bridge there. Might be quite good. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to go and jump up here. And go to the dojo and do this mission. Just so we can progress something in the kind of story a bit. A little bit further. Question is, where is he? I should be right on top of wherever he is. Oh, there he is. All right. Yeah, that's me. What do you want? He doesn't think I'm ready. I know the type. No, you don't. So you presume that I don't know anything. He does, doesn't he? He does. He does. Okay, so we're going to an archery range. Yeah, but I don't think she will. Yeah, why did she turn against? Imagine sharing something important with somebody that you didn't even think you could trust. Also, does he have some kind of leopard's tail as the sheath for his sword? Interesting. I think it's a leopard tail or paw. I would think the tail, probably. Or tiger's tail, maybe, actually. Looks striped rather than spotted, doesn't it? Hmm. 
I have to climb to get there. I think he's probably sure he can make it, yeah. He's probably done it before, right? Where's he going? George, look, he just walked round. He told me I had to climb over. All oh, right. Oh, I said you have to climb. Oh. Right, so I think if anything, the death of that person while I was helping them tells me that when I'm fighting with an ally, assuming I might have to hear, I should probably stay near them. Wait, so the... Okay. The place we're firing to is all the way over there. Whoa. Need to be careful on some of these ledges. It seems like you can drop off really easily. And that's like instant death going off one of these. I don't know why I jumped down there, for example. I think the place I'm going to is up here. Yeah, there's the marker. There's the marker! Right, so what's this? A head in a bag. That's what they're using for target practice. Whoa. Oh. Oh, archers. He's not going to help me. Whoa, what the? They've got a dog? I feel bad. But it is attacking me. Wipe my sword down. Stick it back in my pocket. It's not my pocket, obviously. He did nothing to help me there. Is this his method of teaching? Let these people almost kill me. He knew they were still there, yeah. True. Uh, just, just in the one, and we we were pretty handily routed. <laughs> okay. Where would she have gone? Well, there's some footprints. A dozen men. Yeah, let's go. Hopefully he can keep up. I don't think that's going to be a problem somehow. Don't wait, attack and keep moving. Well, you'll have to, won't you? Mm. So where are we going? I mean, there's a place over there. It'll be as easy as that, just go to that place. More footprints. More footprints. Yeah, we're going the right way at least. Oh, well it is there, what do you know? It is here. Hmm. So... There are people over there. The problem with him is he'll just fire an arrow straight at them without even without even thinking about it. Wonder if I can get him in the head from here. Go.
Good headshots, that's what we want. Alright you guys, whoa, that was a bad idea. But they're going to start killing the hostages if I'm not careful. So if I'm spotted, they'll... And obviously that little symbol that was above their heads. He's quick. But not quick enough. <laughs> Five more and we'll unlock another stance. I think we're done. Yeah, was she here? So she was here. I missed her again. Hot springs. Oh, the town near here. That's that's got hot springs, doesn't it? And now let's go and talk to Ishikawa. Maybe. See what kind of information he's got. Uh-huh. Hiyoshi Springs. Hmm. Yes. Yeah. What? But I shot the people with arrows, like he did, and then stood toe to toe with them, just fighting normally. I didn't sneak up behind them. I didn't sneak up behind them, so what's so bad about that? Was it because I shot them with my bow from hidden, from a hidden position? Who knows? Anyway, I saved that person, so I don't know what he's complaining about. Not really. Charm of efficiency. Cool. And there we go. That is that mission done. So there's another one I can do with him there. And obviously there's some other stuff around about here we can look at. But we're going to make that next time. Um, as I think that's... I'll tell you what, let's go and get this first. Because we'll, the next time we play we're going to do that mission with... Uh, what's her name? Or we could go further south and look at these straw hat ronin. We might do that. But first of all, I'm going to go and collect this gift and talk to this person. Uh, Tanto upgrade available because we got 100 supplies. Chat to him. And we'll do any upgrades that we can do while we're here, actually. Hmm. He's suggesting using bathhouses. That way next time we've got all the upgrades we could possibly need. I think. That's got to be a better idea, right? Just because, and it saves us doing it. Starting the next, uh, the next play of it with me. Tanto upgrades available. Oh, there's a person. Plus, we can pick up some missions if we could, if we do this as well. Terrible battle near Kuta Farmstead. Bandits and Mongols kill. Well, okay, just let them. Yeah, keep away from there until I've dealt with it. Whatever it is, something bad, no doubt. Can't be good, right? Uh, I want to see if I've got any armor upgrades. Possible. I don't think I do because normally if you can upgrade I only need three supplies before I can upgrade my armor. I wonder if I can find any supplies lying around. Because actually that's... 
That'll do it. I could upgrade my sword, but if, uh, but well, it's not my sword; it's the Tanto, so it's my the sword I'm going to use for sneak attacks, um, which might make it easier to kill bigger enemies. But you know, right away, this is a much better, much better armor option. We've got the the helmet and the shoulder protection, and our little mask on as well, so it just looks fantastic. I think. Um, so, in terms of upgrades that are available, I don't think we can do any more. Uh, next time round, we will start out with this tale for Massacre to look for the headman, headman, whatever. Uh, working our way down. Oh, there's a couple of missions there that might be worth doing as well. But I want to look at these at some point, especially this mythic armor and. See if we can get the straw hat Ronin on our side as well. Uh, for now, though, that's going to be where I finish for tonight, I think. Um, so uh, I'll be back. I don't know if I'll be back tomorrow. Uh, I might take tomorrow night off and come back the day after. I'm not too sure yet. You never know. I might come on tomorrow anyway. <laughs> and normally I would do like five days and then have a couple of days off. But most of the time recently I've been doing just every day. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, anyway... Uh, for now, thanks very much for watching. I'll uh, see you next time. And if you have enjoyed what you've been watching, please feel free to hit that uh, that follow button too. Thanks a lot. Good night. Good night for now.